Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. 2013 Honda Civic with 47,000 miles. The customer brought it in and just wanted a tune-up and oil change as he hasn't changed the engine oil or done any service on his vehicle since he bought it brand new. And this customer wanted their brakes looked at after they said they couldn't stop quick enough and got into an accident. This customer installed these aftermarket speakers that are much deeper than factory ones and came in with a complaint that their windows won't go down all the way. Customer states the tire light keeps coming up for the back two tires. The technician said the customer declined getting new tires installed. Two weeks prior, the customer came in for a service and was suggested to get new upper ball joints and wheel bearings. The customer declined the repairs and had just came back on a tow truck. These guys had a pretty close call when they were working on one of their trucks. Well, it's gone. I got it on video. There goes the radiator. Oh my god! That belt let go? Oh my god. Customer states after adding washer fluid, the engine doesn't run. The technician said they think the customer added around 12 quarts of washer fluid to the engine. Also, this is on a fairly new Alfa Romeo with only 1,700 miles on it. And this customer said their AC doesn't work and they use a refrigerant recharge kit, but that didn't fix the issue. The technician found the AC belt snapped due to the AC compressor being locked up. The customer declined all repairs. A Ford dealership has rebuilt a transmission in this vehicle five times in 30,000 kilometers. The customer is at this shop now because they still have issues and the vehicle moves forward in reverse. <laughs> And this customer's snake escaped its enclosure during transportation and made its way in between the dash. The technician removed the dashboard skin and the customer removed the snake. The customer said the snake was still alive and well. This customer came in with a splinter in the tire. The customer said they had a tree fall onto their vehicle which punctured this tire. They tried pulling it out but couldn't so they sawed off the rest and brought in the wheel. This technician made his own custom top for his toolbox. I'll put a link in the description of the photos and steps that he documented when he made this, just in case you're interested. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like or subscribing, and you can submit your clips at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching.